So with these kinds of conflicts, it's about, about being honest with both loving each other as well as what's going on for you, what seems to be going on for you at the time. Yeah. Room cleaning is about power struggles, it's about values, it's about um, individual space, it's about power. You know, so it's really big stuff. Mm. And so the thing is to keep tapping until you come to your honesty about it, even when it sounds horrible, to let yourself have it, and then tap through that back into the unconditional love that you know you have. Even though when I ask you to clean your room and you get really angry and start stomping your feet and throw a big fit and I end up getting upset, I still deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though it makes me really upset when I come in your room and you still haven't cleaned it up and you're just making a bigger mess and screaming and whatever else, I still deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I get really upset and I don't like to be upset about you cleaning your room, I still deeply and completely love and accept myself. Is that right? I, don't <laughs> I know, it just feels funny. Um, I get really upset when I ask you to clean your room and you throw a big fit. It really, really, really upsets me. I get really upset. I don't know, it's really, really, I shouldn't get so upset. I mean, it's only your room, and if you like it that way, then, then it's your thing, not mine. I get, re I get really upset. It makes me really upset. Maybe I feel like you're not listening to me or something or doing your own thing. I'm not sure. But I still love you. It's but I, me as I still, I yeah, I still love you and I still love myself and accept both of us exactly as we are. <laughs>